Hello, my friends. Welcome to the channel. I am here at the Sam's Club because we need gas like ASAP. I think it's $3.79 a gallon here. How are you guys doing? I always love to check in and see how your prices are doing because it shocks and amazes me how different it can be all around the world. Just shocking. Anyway, uh, we're going to go grocery shopping today because <laughs> we need groceries. Imagine that. Here's the thing. I don't know. I've been working out, guys. I've been getting slightly buff. Actually, it just looks more buff than I really am, but I actually have been lifting weights. So one, we need to look for some good protein because we're going through it a lot faster. Two, um, we've been going through fruits and veggies like water. And then three, we've been having a lot of people over and about. So we're going through things much faster. You know how I like to do my once a month grocery haul? Well, here's the mid-month. We're going to do a mid-month grocery haul, get things maybe that we don't normally get, and I'm going to take you along for the journey. We're going to go inside. For those of you that are new, my name is Megan. I've got five kids, homeschool them. They're 11 all the way down to two and a half, almost three next month, and uh, we love to go to the grocery store. So if you love seeing what's new, if you love finding great deals, if you love saving money on your groceries, if you love once a month grocery hauls and regular grocery hauls, I suggest you come along for this ride and have some fun with us, huh? Consider subscribing and uh, let's get going. Store number one, Sam's Club coming up. I don't know how many stores we're gonna go to tonight. I'll let you know. Holy moly, Masta Choli. Velvet hangers, a 50 pack for $11.98. Currently $3 off. That's a good deal. Aldi recently had velvet hangers. Not nearly as good a deal as that. Poffet's Pancake Bites. Those look cute. I haven't seen these before. 9.48, limited time. Ready in as little as 30 seconds. Looks like there's a vanilla flavoring and that's it. With real vanilla extract, which is next level yum. Since I'm in love with protein, I just want to have a look at these. They're supposed to be morning protein bites. I eat a lot of eggs with some pico de gallo and a um, avocado. Okay, four pieces of this will get you 10 grams of protein. I think making my own eggs will do me better, but I'd love to know if you've tried these. 12.88, limited time only, and I'm wondering what your thoughts are, how they taste. Have you guys seen these Hawaiian bread and mini dogs? We just went to the state fair and had corn dogs, which is nothing like Hawaiian bread mini dogs, but I just thought I'd tell you. 12.98 for those, I've never seen them here. Interesting, brand new. Cheesecake factory at home, 12 cheesecake ice cream bars. Eight strawberry, four original, seasonal limited time offering. Listen, I love the Cheesecake Factory all day, every day. Those rolls, I make them myself. They're so good. Eleven ninety eight, limited time. Get in on it now, right? Listen, there are so many new things here at Sam's Club that I'm wondering if we just need to do a whole video on it because I'll be here forever if I show it to you. Like there's something here about pumpkin spice. I don't, we'll do one. You come back. 100% need more salad. So I eat a lot of protein stuff on these salads. 388 for the 16 ounces. And this one's a good one, definitely. Clearly I can make my own chicken, but this is $8.98. 30 grams of protein in just one little doinger right there. Already good to go. I don't know. The kids are just absolutely obsessed right now with apples. So we're gonna go for some more gala. 734 for five pounds. I gotta check these guys over though, make sure nobody squirrely got in there. Nothing looking crazy. Are you shocked that we're getting cucumbers? I'm not, 318 for the three pack. I am going to make some entomotadas with chicken and some corn tortillas. These are $4.68 for the three pounds and they usually taste pretty good. Tomatoes around these parts lately, not great. So these I'm hoping, hoping for the best. Oh, look at the price on the avocados, $3 off, you guys. I was at Costco and their price was like, for something for six of these and I felt so betrayed. I'm like, how dare I buy these at Sam's Club the last time for so much, right? Usually it's $6.98. Well, I'm for sure getting them today. Guacamole, just avocado as it is. You know, you throw a little uh, oregano on there, a little basil, salt, pepper, maybe a little garlic powder and your world is right. $3.98 for five of these. Oh, it's the best day. I'm gonna be doing some meal prepping, so I hope you'll come back for that. Two sixty-eight for the chicken. I've bought so much chicken, and the last one that I got, I'm really disappointed. Now, always remember, and I will say this forever until forever, that the chicken never looks good on screen. So it's more of like see it in real life, and you'll be like, oh yeah, yeah, we're good. I got a super great deal on ground beef that was organic, grass-fed from Aldi recently. 
and the last time I was there the price had changed and maybe they'll bring it back I don't know but I do need some ground beef so $3.98 I'm gonna prep some of this too for just whatever I want I've got ideas I have some really good ideas I'm thinking this one I don't know actually this one looks a little fresher let's go with him two things we haven't had in a long time are frosted flakes and cinnamon toast crunch Cinnamon Toast Crunch is $8.48, the Frosted Flakes $7.88. I'm gonna grab them for my children, they're gonna love me. If you're new to the channel, you don't know this, but we make so much pumpkin chocolate chip muffins, it's out of control all year long, and Sam's Club only has it sometimes. So, it's getting to be that time, and look how much pumpkin they've got here. I do save when I get it at um, elsewhere, but there's something special about when it's here, it makes me really happy. I'm gonna try not to buy these, but they're probably gonna end up in my cart. Probably meaning they're ending up in my cart. These are so good. Oven baked cheese crisps. It's just Parmesan. There's nothing else. And look how much protein, people. $8.98. You just eat them as they are or throw them on a salad. Come on. Brown sugar. We're having the neighborhood kids over tomorrow before they all go back to school. And uh, I need to make them cookies. And it's a need. Like, they need it. $6.98 for the bag of brown sugar because that's what makes the world taste good. We went through our Costco toilet paper so fast and you guys know I was trying it out, comparing it. I thought that the Sam's Club was my preference and um, it's a little bit more. We just went through it super fast. I don't know what the deal was, but $22.98 for this guy and he's going in my cart. I had a chip request. These are $4.48 for the bag. Classic. Are you a Ripples with the wavy or are you the classic? I actually prefer the wavy. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Sam's Club is done. I did scan and go. 139.33 was my total. I'm going to put this in my little uh, bags that keep it all insulated and lovely and cool. And then I think we're going to go to Aldi because we need some stuffs. So let's go. Aldi time, which is strawberry time. 239 for a pound of them. It's a little on the high side, but you know what? We just love our strawberries, so I'm gonna have to go looking through and make sure I find some good ones. Let me do my Sherlocking and I'll find them. They were hiding. They were a hiding. I say that was pretty good. I really love to put blueberries on top of my Faye Greek yogurt with some walnuts and a little drizzle of honey on it. So much protein, so much flavors, so good. Broccoli, $1.89. I am needing some garlic. These seem kind of on the small side though. Hmm. All right, that one looks pretty good. $1.59 for this. $2.29 for green peppers. 89 cents a pound for the sweet potatoes. So I am um, doing like roast these up to 450, then some like fajita seasoning on black beans, cheese, you can do ground beef on there, all this stuff. I can't do rice. So sweet potatoes is kind of like a good carb to throw in there and I just gotta find a good one. That's the one, all right. Fantastic, $1.89 for the pretzels, and I have some leftover almond bark. I'm trying to get rid of stuff in my house by using it, and stuff that's been there for far too long. So I'm gonna do some almond bark chocolate-covered pretzels mm, without a holiday reason to do it. Maple syrup, 100% pure, $5.99. I'm saving myself 50 cents. Oh yeah, we're gonna get some corn tortillas for the entomatadas. And I already have some refried beans at home, but I do make a homemade one that is quite tasty, I will say. So, because I can't do the flour tortillas since I'm gluten-free, I am going to do the corn tortillas and I'm gonna freeze whatever I don't use, but I'm really looking forward to that. Oh, look what they have brand new right now. Dark chocolate thins, almond and sea salt. Rich dark chocolate thins with almond pieces and sea salt. I bet that has protein in it. Oh my word, it has two for four pieces. Wow. I mean, yeah, $2.99? <laughs> I mean, we probably should try that. Oh darn, it contains, it may contain wheat. Well, just kidding, friends. Tell me how you like it. I bet they're amazing some cute stuff here at Aldi this week. Salt and pepper mill. I love that kind of matte look. How cool are those two toned little dipped utensils? The Rattatan water pitcher. 
Well, hot diggity dog, I do declare. Oh, and then baking pans. Is that a springform pan? Oh, so if you want to make some uh, cheesecake in there, yes. I don't know if Aldi just thinks all we do is sit around in our beds and eat stuff, but I mean, I kind of like the idea of it. <laughs> These are fantastic. Holy cow. These are like heavy duty. Wow, I really like that. Oh wow, that's all they've got for milk right now. And it already has a September date. You guys, life's going by way too fast. 247 for these. So many eggs. I eat so many, $1.12 a dozen. And I'm going to grab three of them. We go through these babies. Listen, one thing that I really like to do on my channel is give people tips and tricks. How to save money, waste less, all that stuff. Well, listen. I'm going to pass along my protein tips to you. Yeah, I bought it. You know why? <laughs> it's not because I needed a treat. It's because it had five grams of protein in it. And I thought, well, that's good. Just the whole package. And I'm going to eat it. So if you need protein in your life, <laughs> grab yourself a little checkout candy and impulse buy. Hmm. We got one more place to go, shall we? Oh, you probably want to know all these total. I don't know. I think it was 36, 33? 36, 33. That sounds about right. Okay, now we're going to go on. Let's go. We're here at the Wally, 47 cents for the bananas. And I'm thinking we've really slowed down in the world of banana eating. So if I get just those six, most likely that won't be enough. But if I get more, it'll be too much. What can you do? $1.38 a pound for the onions. I don't think that's gonna cost me $1.38. Quite a bit less, I imagine, but red onions, yes. I need some Dijon mustard for a recipe, $1.50. Guys, they don't have Duke's mayo here, so we're just gonna go for the great value. I'm gonna be making some tuna and um, needs a little mayo in it, you know, maybe a little bit of uh, celery seed, maybe some pickles cut up in there. How do you guys like your tuna or do you like it at all? Some people are like totally disgusted. Anyway, great value, 216. We got neighborhood kids coming over tomorrow. We're gonna make pizza, so I'm grabbing pepperonis. These are 328. The other option, which would be cheaper, are spicy hot and most kids I know aren't into that. Wow, they've changed the weedy box. Okay, we haven't bought Wheaties actually in quite a long time. Four ninety eight for the box. T J Watt linebacker. Okay, defensive end. I'm thinking the bread is a dollar fifty six. I don't see it labeled, but I'm pretty sure it's dollar fifty six. I'm grabbing two loaves of the white bread. Peppermint candies, six fifty seven. One of my kids were recently asking about these, so I'm gonna grab them today. Five thirty six cookie dent, which I think they'll like them over the like nutted outside just because they're not super into that vanilla vanilla fudge and vanilla caramel oh, oh, oh. also we've just been getting chocolate ice cream but today we're gonna get mint chocolate too 67. check out these ice creams zebra cakes honey buns unicorn fudge rounds the strawberry shortcake rolls star crunch oh i haven't had one of those in so long nutty bars there are so many yummy options how many of you have tried them Ooh, oatmeal cream pie, my absolute favorite. Like the sweet saltiness of it. Anybody else sense the saltiness of it? So good. I had to show you these two. These are sweet potato thumbprint cookies. I don't think that I've ever seen sweet potato thumbprint cookies here. Maybe because I'm always like looking at these since they're my absolute favorite. But have you guys seen those at Walmart before? I know that you guys make them, some of you, but I didn't know they were here at the store. Guys. I don't think I've ever seen a more beautiful fall section at the Wally. We're going to do fall at the Wally, so be prepared for that video. The beauty down this aisle is, I mean, this is like Hobby Lobby, but then some. I don't even feel like I'm at the Wally. Oh. <laughs> I love fall so much. Can you tell? I love it so much. Let's go check out and then we'll chat again. Oh, you guys, I can't wait to go back to Walmart and show you all of the fall stuff. It was gorgeous. Like I love fall things and I've already seen them at Hobby Lobby. I've seen some at Target. I've seen them at a little bit here at uh, Sam's Club, Meyer, that kind of thing. I don't know. Those were speaking to me. So we're coming back. We're going to have a looky at those. Uh, my total there was 32.13, I think. 
So all together, I think we were spending just around $200 for all the treasures that we needed. <laughs> so much protein, especially in that Reese's peanut butter cup and uh, so much good stuff to get us through, you know, the next bit here. So thank you guys for hanging out with me. I hope that you're doing well. I would love for you to subscribe, come hang out with us. And don't forget, if you want to check out my vlogging channel, you can pop over to Megan Birch and I will see you over there as well. So have an amazing day and I will talk with you soon. Bye guys.